Okay. Um, this is as of man is sprout and stone. Let's go. Oh, that would help. The first day. Where's the volume at? Oh. I'm back, little one. Is that me? Is that me? Which one's me? You want to go outside? You have to go potty? Right now? We just started. See this dog? Come here. Come here. Mm. Nice chair. Thanks. Do you need to go to, you need to go outside? You have to go potty? You just want attention? Do you want to come up? No? Okay, come here. Um, would you like a treat? Are you hungry? Oh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. Oh shit, it's the new Pinocchio, but he grew up. Give Holly a treat. Yeah, all right. All right. Man. Okay, I apologize. Oh. Classic Holly. Hope everybody liked this music that played. Okay. <laughs> Still here. I'm glad. Have you been... Well, hmm, leaves healthy. Hmm, do you no? No pruning, then. Very well. Blessed by mother soil. You are indeed. So, let's begin, hmm? Same as always, same as ever. It's a lot of water. <laughs> Enough already? Well, well, you know best. Well then, <clears throat> give me just a moment. I will go and get the book, all right? Let's see. Oh, wow. Did you want to hear Colody the Clever again? Hmm? How about we look at some of the other stories in here, too? What of the story of how, uh... 
brave Lady Espy fought against the great beast at her root. When to her aid came... Too frightening? Oh, well, I'll leave it aside for some other time. Hmm. Oh, well, I'll be. We've, well, gone through the stories I had. Okay, why, the book is finished. Oh, whatever shall I do now? Clearly, there must be some solution to this. Hmm. I can't just leave you without a story for the night after all. But, come to think of it, little seedling, have I ever told you of your home? A wonderful, welcoming, truly, and positively quaint, faraway land. Right beyond that door. Surely you must wonder where I go when you leave your curls up for the night, no? I've never brought you outside, after all. I wish I could show you. I'm sorry, little one. But, well, maybe there's something else I can do. How about a story, hmm? <clears throat> Let me see. Oh. Now, hmm, let me think. What is this, dude? Ah, well, perhaps I should start with the room itself. Uh, it is nature itself, seedling. Wooden boards, lush green walls. I did not cultivate this place, but uh, I wish I had. To call something so beautiful your own must feel unimaginable. Hmm, let's see. Oh, what is it, little seedling? Have I... Oh, no. My apologies. I almost forgot. Of course, our little room. Is actually a hallway. And like any good hallway, of course. It has a great many branches splitting off in all directions. So then... How about it, seedling? What if we make this your story too? You can't talk to me, but... Here. Let me just take off my glove. Reach out to my hand. Oh. That should be enough to allow me to share in some of your will. You'll be able to see all this with your own eyes. Well, then, let us go, little seedling. Oh, interesting. One of many such hallways. They turn corners like whips and seem to never end. Do you want to keep this memory? Yeah. Okay, that's your save point, huh? Oh, you want to go back already? Hmm. Are you sure you're satisfied? There's so much to tell you about. What say we go back and take one more look, hmm? Sir. Yes, siree. Over here. I beg your pardon, but are you forgetting something? Oh, right. Shrubbins, the, uh, butler. I'm sure he tries his best, but I never asked him to. He seems like he's having fun, though. Now, now. I know, I know. Stop it, Shrubbins. It's fine, Shrubbins. But, 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 sir. Please. With all due respect, you, you cannot go out like this. Who are you meeting with? Are they important? And you'll be wearing this? No. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. Leave those rags in that horrible hat with me. There's still time, sir. Yo, Parody with the raid. What's going on, everybody? Welcome. We are playing a game called Azomatis Sprout and Stone. It's a demo, I believe. We're just checking it out. Thanks for uh, the raid. I sewed them myself. I don't even own any other clothes. And I haven't seen another soul in ages. I really don't know where he gets it from. But it wouldn't be the same without him. Yo, what's up, dude? What were you playing? I hope stream went well. Dig the designs going on here? Me too. It's very pretty. Sir, please. Please, sir. No, not that again. Remember Eleven, an old visual novel. That's cool. Well, I hope it was fun. 
Okay. Can we just go down the door? Oh, my personal quarters? Of course you'd be curious. This is where I spend most of my time anyway. Is this room you want to learn about today? Yeah, sure. A little hallway here. Yeah, the track is pretty. Let's see. Ah, of course. We're not quite there yet. This here is the uh, common room, is the term, I believe. It's usually quiet here, but it looks like there's quite the commotion today. Okay. An unassuming break room with a small kitchen, but there are many others like this in the complex. This one is the closest. Do you want to keep it? Yeah. Please don't leave your leaves. Clean up after yourselves and let others know. Cleanliness is a group effort. Sign shrubbins. Underneath the word no. Wait. Oh, no. Somebody wrote no on it. Oh, hi. Hmm? All these people? Didn't you know? The chef's preparing a big farewell feast, you know. The usual. For who? Heck if I know. No, no, no. No time. Can't think. Can't talk. Please. I need to do my work. Oops. Mew! Hee 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 hee. Everyone's waiting for their stew, but I'm just enjoying the free OJ. Brought my own. Didn't cost me anything. Don't tell anybody. Hey ho, friend. Did you get your bowl yet? No? Has anyone? Just me? Ah, some soup, please. Please, hurry. Do you want to help? Change your rooms later and alter character dialogue. Yeah. I can't do this anymore. I'm done. It's over. They'll see where they get what where they'll where they get their stew now. Hmm. What's that? Soup. Yes, I remember that. I remember soup. I haven't been allowed to make any in a long time. I used to love soup as a kid, you know, it was a real soup fiend. But then I left the forest and came here and all I ate anymore was stew. Every day, for every meal, stew, stew, stew. It gets tiring, you know. The chef doesn't make anything- uh, In fact, they even got angry when I sneak a bit of it, but I need to eat too. Oh god. Yo, DZ, what's up, baby? I hope stream was good, buddy. All right, this guy's going off. Bro is going off. Uh, about soup. I can get you some. I make it in secret for myself sometimes. When the chef isn't looking, you can have some, but let's make it a deal. I've been in here for long enough. I'm tired of going through the motions day in, day out. And I can't just quit. You get me? Once the chef notices I'm gone, well, I don't think it'll be pretty. <laughs> so I need someone to cover for me. You can find someone to replace me. You can have as much soup as you want. All right? I have to look out for myself here, too. Uh, sorry. Okay. So I gotta find somebody for this? Soup. No soup. Only stew. Go. Oh, crap. Want any? Or maybe you'd rather have some carrot juice? It's a very painful process. Please don't. All right, I don't know what's going on anymore. Wait, can I have your, your soup? Oh, you want to go work at the kitchen? Ah, oh. But I'm already so overwhelmed by just one bowl of stew. <laughs> Your head hurts? You've ever seen me a new Pokemon sound? Hell yeah. Oh, Mew's leaving? Oh. Wish him good luck for me. Say, does he need anyone to fill in? Oh, I knew it. Well, I always thought I'd be good at that sort of thing. What do you think? No. Oh, all right. I hope you stay safe. What? What do you want, huh? What? What? Chef's looking for work. Huh. <laughs> you think you'll take me? It's finally my big break, eh? Ha <laughs> ha! I knew it! I tell you. I bet that other guy got kicked out because he's too slow. Hee <laughs> hee! I'll be on my way right now. Take that, Mew. Ma! <laughs> Alright, nice. Nice. Yeah, I don't know. This anti suit propaganda is kind of not hitting right. Oh, look at him go! 
Hmm. Mew is different today. Redder, more dangerous. No matter. Work continues. You... Gardener. Take care. Hey. Thank you. So much. Seems like the newcomer's pretty eager to be doing this, huh? I'm not sure his technique is very, uh... Sustainable, but... Hey, if the chef's fooled, it's all good. People are waiting for their stew, after all. Hope even that guy can catch a break someday, though. Anyway, I'm a fungus of my word. Here. Got some soup. Thanks. I'll be taking a break now for a long time. Nice. You deserve it, little buddy. Ah, uh, is that soup I smell? Come on, gimme. Ah, much better. What? I just had a craving. Rude. But thanks for the soup, you're very kind. Hell yeah. Oh. And here we are. My own very little place. It's, uh, a little underwhelming, I know. Still, I tried to make it as cozy as I could. Oh, I, uh, must have forgotten to turn that off. This pipe here goes directly into the ground. I don't know exactly how it works, but there's water down there. Uh, somewhere. I couldn't find anything in the library about maintenance, so... I just left it as is. Let's just hope it keeps working, hmm? Haha. <laughs> it's a bag of fur. Right, yes, a fertilizer. I found a whole lot of these over in the greenhouse. According to my books, this should be more than enough for quite a while. I... Tried some out on myself once, a long time ago. Soil and everything. Wood is wood, no? It all comes back to plants in the end. But, uh, that's not quite how it worked. All I could think about then was getting stronger. But all I did was make Shrubbin's comment on the smell. I've never seen the old man so angry. Oh, uh, yes. The pruning shears. You know about these. Too well, hmm? You really do grow at a remarkable rate. I'm really worried that I'm hurting you with these. I'm trying my best to be gentle and efficient, but I'm sorry, seedling, but it's a necessary evil. If you grow too large, I... Well, for one, I wouldn't be able to find a bigger pot. I'm lucky you were small enough when I found you to <clears throat> fit into one of the soup bowls from the kitchen. It's better than nothing, no? Yo, what up, Arthur? That is not Pinocchio, but close. The book is full of... <clears throat> Advice and useful knowledge for any aspiring gardener. I tried looking for something more specific, but, well, this will have to do. If you ever feel neglected, you'll let me know through your will, alright? I'm sure I'll be able to understand, somehow. I'll do my best. Well, not gnarled or wooden at all, hmm? I believe I found this in some long abandoned part of the house. Truth be told, seedling, uh, I don't need to sleep. But it does make things feel a little more normal, no? Almost like a real home. <laughs> Thank you, Daddy. I knew you... The, literally. Oh, save point. I wonder why. As you look into the light, you can feel old memories coursing through the gardener's hand. That's kind of cool. This is a cool little game so far. I like the dialogue a lot. And this idea of just like strange spaces. Oh. What is the name of this game? Azomatis Sprout and Stone. A S O M A T U S. Living space, approximately one person. Absence of task, relevant assets. Discarded from memory. Downloading this now. Nice. 
This one looks pretty. This is pretty good so far. Very cute. Color? Oh. I was lost in thought. Have you seen all you wanted to? Hmm? Just leave me back to your room whenever you grow bored of all this. Let's keep grooving, dude. <clears throat> Did we check what's up here? Meatball! Uncle Meatball. Thanks for the sub, baby. I love you, buddy. I appreciate you, buddy. Four is a big number. We have a big friendship. <laughs> big ol' friendyship. Can I get an uwu, Uncle Meatball? Can you oo us? Oh, you want to go back already? I thought you... Please don't stand so close to my face. <laughs> True. This is the way to the library, but... Hadn't you already decided that you wanted to know about the living quarters instead? I guess. Ah, that's... Well, it used to be the greenhouse or something resembling one. Do you remember? Well, one of the plants really, uh, took charge and spruced up the entire wing. I think they're a kingdom now. Either way, though, they've become very odd indeed. I haven't been there in a long time. Let's say we leave this one for another day when I've had a chance to recall, hmm? Let's not go outside just yet, Seedling. There's plenty more to talk about in here, after all. Okay, so I literally do go back. Even though it's like, hey, are you sure you want to go back? <laughs> Very well. Yeah, I like that too, Catherine. I like how the player insert is the little guy. The little seedling. I'll be back tomorrow, all right? Just a little guy, you know? Are you doing all right? I'm sorry that I've been away all day. I needed to... Well, how do I explain? I had to do maintenance. Do you know what that means? This place, you see, it's... Uh, there's a lot more to it than you'd think. I can't tell you about all of it now, but... Every once in a while I have to round all those corners, walk all those hallways. To see if everything still works. If it all still holds together. And as much as I know how this place works anyway, uh, anyhow. <laughs> I took a lot of notes over time. An important step here, a little detail to keep in mind there. Now it's just a routine I need to go through every so often. Let's see. The last time was... Well, of course. That was before you uh, arrived here. Do you still remember where I found you? Ah, I'm sorry, Seedling. No need to worry about it, hmm? I'm sorry if I troubled you. 
What? What are you doing? Why are you mentally manipulating a plant? Oh, yes, that's right. I almost forgot. I brought you something. You see, out of all the rooms I need to take a look at every once in a while, there's one that is very peculiar. Most rooms are empty and rather sparse. Usually I'd just take a look inside and if everything seems fine, I would move on. But there is one place I found. It's full of colors and shapes you couldn't even imagine. I don't think I could do it justice. There, all over the tables, the floors, the walls. Clothes. Wonderful, colorful clothes and fabrics. It must have housed some sort of tailor once, no doubt. The people must have gone there to get, have their clothes fixed, but all they ever wore were those drab gray robes. I wonder what all those fabrics are for and why they left them here to rot. It's all, it's a little sad. I often think about the tailor that must have worked there all alone. I wonder if they were happy. I wonder if this was their little freedom to express themselves. Ah, of course. I got a little sidetracked there, didn't I? Well, you see, every time I'd make the rounds, I would spend some extra time in there, just taking it all in. And then, eventually, I began to look more closely with purpose. I started studying the cuts and the seams, the tools, the colors, and the way it all came together. I don't think I'm anywhere near as good, but... Here. I made this for you. <gasps> it's got a hat! The plant has a hat! It's so cute! Do you like it? Oh, you can't see yourself, of course. Well, then let me be the one to tell you that you look quite dapper, indeed. Haha. <laughs> Does it bother you? Should I take it off again? No, I like it. I like it. Ah. Uh, hmm. I'm happy that it fits you well. A little gift for me. It suits you. More like sapper. <laughs> Now, let us continue where we left off yesterday, hmm? Question, does Mandian have facial hair? He does. He has like a little chin strap beard. Okay. Hey, buddy. Now that I don't have to cook anymore, can I I can hang out anywhere I want. How'd you like that soup? Or was it for someone else? <laughs> I won't tell. Absolutely, dude. This is the way to the library. I learned a lot from all the books here, so I presume it's time to pass on some of that knowledge. Is this where you want to go? No. Of course. Take your time. We have plenty of it. This is an RPG Maker game? Yes. Let's not go outside just yet, seedling. Plenty more to talk about. Ah, uh, that's... Okay, so we are going to the library. This is the way to the library. I learned a lot from all the books they left here. So I presume it's time to paint... Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, no, I meant to go there. <laughs> hmm. That's right, the hallway. Ah, uh, this one's quite the change of scenery, hmm? Hmm. 
We're not quite in the main room yet, but there's still plenty here. Now, let's see. How was it? Oh. Ah. Let your eyes adjust for a moment, seedling. We have quite a bit of reading to do. If you want, of course. Just show me anything you want to know about. All the books in the bookshelf are upside down. How careless. Look unimportant. Very important. Okay, these are all dumb. A ladder. Seems like it's not sturdy enough to be usable. Hmm. Plenty of books here. A lot of them don't make sense to me. Books about belief, about morals, about war. The people who lived here before me were complicated, seedling. Many of them were not nice, but I can't complain, I suppose. With all the things they left behind, I'd, I'd be able to care for you for a long, long time. The bookshelf shifts and wavers before you. You take out a fancy looking book and open it. The callous, on callous drifter, a, finding, a founding diatribe. Once abandoned, we became strong. Once strong, we became unrelenting. He spoke creation and left us. We, in turn, pierced its very center. Without his guidance, without his help, and so I ask of you now a question near to my heart. A question we must all share in our newfound strength. Do we not have the right to demand an answer? Not all the books in there are here are that dry and uh, are so dry and pompous, though. People put all sorts of things into writing, seedling. Sometimes I open a book and find a signature or a little message to a friend or a loved one. Sometimes I find letters that someone stuck into the shelf and forgot. It's sad to think that many of them never found their recipient. Even the people here were human after all, it seems. One day, they just left and never came back. I'm worried about him. They made him a saint last week. This week, I haven't seen him at all. My brother, right there at the top. I still can't believe it. What do we call them saints for? I thought we'd been abandoned. Why have we started calling them that again? I kind of think I know what I'm look at, like what we're getting into here. A carved statue. It somewhat resembles the gardener. Seedling, this this one is. The bookshelf shifts and wavers before you. You take out a simple but professional-looking letter and open it up. The body is a puppet imbued with and inhabited by traces of life. Anything can act as a body. The presence of life greatly changes the properties of any given object. Note from ID. Explore this further. We cannot determine its origins, but the life we give it, it seems to possess inherent human qualities. It thinks. It feels. It knows things. Things it shouldn't know. We're not working with a blank slate here. This will pose a problem. Underneath, there's a handwritten note in a different font. I don't like this. Please think it over. I beg of you. Interesting. Interesting. Bookshelf shits and wavers before you. Take out a single sheet of paper. We finally make it over here, and this is the first thing you do? What are you thinking? Those people did nothing to you. It's all just his newest toy box. He'll abandon them too in time. They are like we were, Idion. Please. It's not too late to change your mind. It's not too late to scrap all these dolls of yours. I can't do anything here. It's my word against the saints. Yours, Idion. Your responsibility. I refuse to grovel at your feet. If you declare war, then I refuse to consider us family any longer. Okay. This is a cool game. Very deep story. You want to pass through. You are in luck. I feel a strange kinship. Creatures carved from wood. The both of us. I am a tool for a tool. Answer me this. Are you happy? Yes. Yes, I uh, see it in your eyes. You have come to rest long ago, but there is something else to take care. 
of the little one. Won't you? Open up, baby. <laughs> now go. We will surely meet again. Okay. Birds. Uh-oh. Mama, mama, look. The word wood bird is here again, mama. The big wood bird. It's here again. Look, look. Did you bring me something? Did you want to see my mama? Hi. Hi, hi, hi. You're here. One day I freed all the birds. We spent three... <laughs> Got him. We spent three weeks and took off the roof and we moved all the shelves up the walls. You'd love them. They love you. They love everyone. I'm glad they're still here. Hi! Can you tell me a story again? No. Whoa. Hello. Oh! Welcome again. The little red one has told me. This is your home. As it is my home. You have given refuge for the little ones. I will do the same for you. The wheel of kindness turns. <laughs> Bird up. Bam, bam, bam. Oh? Hey, boss. I'm wondering about all the big statues, eh? Well, found some old blueprints for them over in that dusty library room. They look kind of like you, so I thought, hell, why the heck not? Even gave them your clothes, see? Gotta say, though, all kinds of complicated schematics on those. So many moving parts. A lot of sharp ones, little mechanisms. Layers and layers and layers. Look mighty dangerous, some of them did. Some of the little birdies here might hurt themselves, so I left all that stuff out. And, well, look at them. Beautiful, right? And they're standing up just fine. <clears throat> Don't know what, that, what they'd ever need all that junk for. Hey, boss, before I forget, got a little something for you, too. Only had your stories to go off of, but I tried my hardest to make it look accurate, yeah? Go on, take it. It's yours. Free of charge. Hey. Oh. Hmm. Oh, you want to go back already? Are you sure you heard all you wanted to here? Yes. Yes. Good night, seedling. I will be back tomorrow, all right? Okay. Mm hmm. Yo, Edge Juice, what's up, buddy? We're playing a game called Azo Madness Sprout in Stone. It's pretty cool. Not really sure what's going on yet, though. I'm early today, aren't I? Haha. <laughs> I suppose I'm making up for the time we lost yesterday. Is everything all right? Say, seedling, Pinocchio's cousin as the protag. Yep, exactly. What do you say we make today a big day? Hmm? I'll I'll be here with you all day and tell you a great big story. That'll be fun, no? Well, 
before we get to that, I, uh, I brought you something again today. I, uh, made... I had it made by that peculiar woodpecker that lives in the library. You remember her, don't you? I told you about that place. Well, how do you like your hat, hmm? I did seem to recall that it was quite unfortunate that you couldn't see how you looked. And... And then I had an idea. I was going to give this to you later, but... What? Let's say we... Uh, may I take it off of you? Alright then. There. Do you see it now? A perfect mirror image of yourself. Quite accurate, too. Trust me. That hat suits you well, no? Haha. <laughs> I'm sorry if it is a little silly to you. I'm an old fool. Still, I would be touched if you kept it. Yo, what's up, coin? and coin? I'm doing good, dude. I hope you're doing good as well. That's from my... Oh, you PRC. Thanks for the bid, dude. Oh, I thought I had more bits left before I clicked it here. Oh, well, here's one cent for you, Ricky. Don't spend it all in one place. Thanks, dude. Appreciate it. And I hope you'd be able to say it with pride. Hmm. Ah, yes. Sorry. One moment. There we go. All good again, hmm? Now, enough with the preambles. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's hit the, let's hit the Dougie, dude. Let us dive into a day of wandering together through my story of our home. I know just the place for today. Brink. All right. I took a visit to the library, you know. See what else is out there. I tried to get into the main hall, but the door was closed. And I think that's very rude. Hey, ho, friend. I brought my bowl out here so I'd feel less awkward eating with no one around. Or so I thought. Why are there so many people in the hallway? I'll never be able to eat my stew at this rate. Ah, sir, it's a miracle. A miracle, I tell you. The birds, you see, they brought me right over to this troublemaker. Now to give him a good earful, I thought. But he didn't even know what he'd done. It is my duty to show this youth a path to a better future. In fact, I've been teaching him all I know. This is the third time we've gone over proper cutlery etiquette, and he keeps asking questions. Oh, I dare say this is the most fun I've had in ages, sir. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Okay. How are you? Ah, uh, I see. The greenhouse or, well, what they made of it at least. Do you still remember? I haven't been there in a long time, but sure, why not? Let's see what we can tell, what I can still tell you. Hmm. Let's see, you see, there's barely any traces of the original greenhouse left. They were very diligent and insisted that this was going to be a kingdom, not a mere home. Hmm. Gray bricks, gray floors, very colorless affair, but... Oh, they take themselves very seriously after all. Well, let's meet the royal household, shall we? Ceremonial shield made of cardboard. Oh. What to do, what to do? It's a large painting of a knight. Great Lady Espy. Letty. Unlocked. There's nothing inside except a small plaque. For sale. Where are you, Letty? 
fire. Dangerous. Small model of the castle. He briefly admired the intricate details of the price tag. Fire. Very dangerous. Hello? Y y you, uh, I, um, sorry. Wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry. You, um... You are... Uh, uh, oh, I'm so, so, so sorry. Welcome to our um, salutations and be welcomed by um, uh, by me to our, our castle? To, to my castle, I think. I don't believe we've ever met. Can I um, interest you in any of our souvenirs? I'm sorry, the, um, the king is absent and the royal halls are uh, uh, off limits until he's back from the catacombs. You'll have to come back some other time, okay? Feel free to, um, look around, though. It's all for sale now. Ever since our treasure went down below, there's... There's, um... We're a bit short on funds right now, see? I'm the one... Only one who's still... The... The painting isn't for sale, please. Enjoy your stay. Hmm. Catacombs, catacombs. Seedling, I'm afraid I can't quite recall this one anymore. I haven't been here in it for a long time, I'm sorry. Let's say we take another look at the painting and I'll tell you the story of Lady Espy again, hmm? Interesting. Um. Uh oh. Now this isn't... Please wait! Phew. Oh. I'm terribly sorry, but can I ask you for something? I love the guy's portrait too. You see, almost the entire court has gone down into the catacombs in search of that horrible beast. But there was one of our most honorable knights, Xanavox, who vowed to keep me company until the very end. She... she also left, just recently. I... I can't deal with this on my own. Please, you have to help me find her again. But... this is... Supposed to? Nothing is supposed. To. This isn't the story I wanted to tell. What are they? No. What am I? What, what am I talking about? Seedling, I, I think I may be a bit out of sorts today, and yet, can, can you hear me? No. 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 Who am I even? Of course I can hear you. Are you feeling all right? Oh, I know I shouldn't have asked. I'm so sorry. This is too much, isn't it? Seedling, I think we should take a little break. Don't you worry about them. I'll check back later and see if I can uh, help. I need to, I might need to take a little walk. Whoa, it just cut me out. And so the gardener and the seedling ventured down deep below the court. That's the seedling? What? Seedling, when? When did we get to this part? Is, is something the matter? Oh, yes. I forgot to introduce myself, didn't I? My name is Tremo, humble servant of His Majesty, Chancellor of our Royal Court. And, well, current regent, I guess, for lack of a better option. No, no, it's fine. That's not... Seedling, I don't know what's happening. Oh! They come across the catacombs of old, end of many a journey. This is getting creepy. Hey, Faraville. This is called Adam Azomatis, Sprout and Stone. We've made it. This is the entrance to the catacombs. It's a little dangerous in the King's Court and Kin descended deep down to the ruin. I didn't click nothing, by the way. See, let go of my hand. 
Castle's caretaker now after them with help this time. Okay. To find the errant knight on their foolish journey. What is happening? And meet once more. Oh, uh, what? Where? What? Where is this? The style changed. How did we... Hold on. Where's Tremo? Where are we? Won't open. This must be some kind of prison then? Hmm, perhaps. Aha, seedling. I might be able to fit you through the bars. We'll have to part ways for a bit, but maybe you can find some sort of key. Just please, please be careful. If anything seems unusual, even just a little bit, you'll come right back here, okay? I'll get you back inside. I'd rather we stick together. It, please, don't take any risks, all right? I can't bear the thought of something happening to you. You'll be able to move here, I think. This is just a story, after all. <gasps> oh. Holy cow. This is wild. Locked tight. Locked very tight. Oh, what is happening now? Is it spooky now? Is this a horror game? <laughs> a strange flower lies nestled within the alcove. Okay. Do you want to keep this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Combat? Lost shrub? Oh. The enemy seems too strong to defeat. It seems all is lost. But suddenly, 
Have no fear, tis merely a common shrub. Have at thee. Vile foe. My turn, I get the killing blow. Thou art hesitating. Very well, I shall do the deed. Thou art safe now. Allow me to introduce myself. Nice. Level two. I am Xanavox, honored knight of great renown, in service of his majesty once more. My descent into this place serves to recover the remnants of our noble court. However, I do not recognize thy face, except perhaps... No, no, it could not be. Little Bloom, what brings you here? The catacombs are a treacherous place. Didst thou fall from above? What be it, then? Dost thou wish to show me something? Very well. Lead the way. Oh. Damn, we're RPGing now. It's a weird game. Oh! One moment, I didn't expect a visitor. Right over here. Hiya! Welcome to me! And my... Hold on. I've never seen either of you. Uh, in any case, magnificent armor, a shining blade. Um, and here I thought they had all fallen prey to the beast. What a wonderful sight. And you, the other one. So small, a little one, hmm? I can barely see you under that hat. A little one and a valiant knight. Ha ha ha, well. Don't let me stop you from your clearly important business. I wish you, um, great luck. Be on your way, valiant hero. Okay. Why? Wade. Hmm. I thought I heard another foul creature. Nothing. The path is clear. Uh oh. That looks like a foul creature. Oh, seedling, is everything all right? Are those footsteps? Did you find someone who can help? Little Bloom. I know who this man is. Could it be that you, thou art indeed? That's seedling. Did you find Xanavox? That's incredible. Now we just need to hurry and find out where Tremo ended up and we can... Oh, that's right. Can she, um, unlock the door somehow? Please, permit me to speak. Oh, hello. We've been looking for you, I believe. You are Xanavox, no? You. You, who stole away our kingdom's future. You, who committed the highest treason. Your schemes have finally caught up with you. Let it be known, then, that the prince has returned to us, and his captor detained. There is no more need to talk to this criminal. I am glad thou hast returned to us. Now come, prince. Allow me to guide thee. Is there a problem? I see. I will do as you ask, and be rid of this villain once and for all. Prince, what is the meaning of this? But I could... 
Seedling, it's fine. I believe I know what this is about. Do not take another step towards the prince, fiend. I will strike you down here and now. Uh-oh. All right, let's see what we got. Hmm. Give me the pleasure of fighting back, wretch. Thy pitiful protest means nothing in the face of death. I see. So you surrender. Ha. Huh. Very well. It pains me to grant you mercy, but it appears that the prince wishes it so. We shall move on, see court and king, and I shall present you before them. May his judgment strike true. And until then, I will watch your every move. And if you impede the prince's training any longer, I'll kill you. Alas, we venture forth. Come, prince, and you, prisoner, keep up the pace. Hmm. Okay, so we do have to go this way. Mm. Oh, I don't like that. Hold on, seedling. Can you hear that? Stay your tongue, prisoner. My apologies, but I believe there is someone talking. Hmm. Raph, please. Knight and little one, you, just, you can't, they've done nothing. Very well, let us go ahead. Hmm. Wait! Oh, ha ha ha, um, why don't you stay a while longer, um, and then you could, uh, I mean, we could, uh, no, wait. Oh, why do I bother? I see you found someone new. Please, you three, listen to me. I, you, just, just go, quickly now, before he, hey, 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 what's that I hear? Oh, boy. Alicia, Alicia, you can't just send good customers away. I'll just have to... Talk to them myself! Oh, what the heck? What? The gardener does not fight. Your name is Raph, correct? I don't know why you're doing this, but it seems that Licia may prefer to avoid this conflict. Let's put an end to this, huh? Fight, coward, where I will put thee to the sword this very moment. Yeah, he he, that's the spirit. Shine, shut thine mouth, fiend, and prepare to leave this world. He he he, hey, lady, no need to get so personal. We're all reasonable here, aren't we? <laughs> throw some kind of object at you. Stop, can't you see that you're putting innocent people in danger? Neither the prince nor your friend over there wanted any of this. Neither did I if a prisoner's prisoner's word count, still counts for anything. Please, I'm sure we can compromise regardless of what it is you want. 
Hey, hey, wood guy. Hey, did you just say prince? Indeed, it is now wilt. Whoa, whoa, ho, ho, ho. If I had just known, well, forgive me, your majesty. Spare the majesty. Well, king and knight, eh? What say we point you in the right direction? Tempting, eh? And in exchange, you'll forget about this, right? Knave. A deal it is then. Hee hee hee. Now that this is settled, I believe that it may be best for all of us to simply leave them be and move along. Hmm. Perhaps. The prince's safety comes before all else. Very well. Well, sorry about that. Thank you. Exit's, um, left. No, not that it wasn't already obvious. Ah, <sighs> Raph. What? It was an honest mistake. What do we even need their things for? We need money, Alicia. We could have started a legitimate business, you know. Hey, hey, hey. You know that I'm bad with people. Raph, I think we should go back to the surface. Looting just isn't for us. Are you kidding? This is the most fun I've had in ages. There's a hole down there. Move on. Yep. Yo, SFP with the raid. Welcome in, SFP. What's up, buddy? Welcome, up. Welcome uh, in, raiders. What's going on? We're playing a game called Azomatis. <sighs> it's pretty cool so far. What am I doing? Going deeper. Oh. Oh, very. Halt. You were scared? A prisoner. I will ask you a question. Back there, you mentioned someone by the name of Tremo. Well, we met them. Silence. Do not interrupt me. When you met them... What were they like? Answer. They seemed fairly beside themselves, I believe. An entire kingdom's worth of responsibilities does appear to be a great burden. They talked about you too, if I recall. You were the last to leave, no? I do not recall allowing you to speak of out of turn. Of course. Excuse my boldness. You had no stream sound. Oh, welcome. Well, what's up, SFP? How was stream? You said then that you were looking for me. Bold indeed. I know that I have taken your measure long ago. Oh, hell yeah, it's cool to see you combine chat. Oh, thanks, dude. You stand no chance, wretch. Stand no chance. Knight Xanavox, I believe you may be mistaken about my intentions. I harbor no ill will towards you or the court. Spare me the excuses, traitor. In truth, it was Tremo who led us on the search. Tremo led you here? Answer, no. They did indeed. They led me in my they led me to the prince and right up to the entrance of the catacombs. Hugging a YouTube chat. <laughs> we fell down a hole and landed in that cell. The prince was able to slip through the bars, but I was not. Trima was not there anymore. I don't know where they fell. Liar. What have you done to them? Nothing. I swear on my life. May you take it as if I may you take it if I deceive. Prince, allow me to consult thee. Is this man telling the truth? Two hops means yes. I, but why? We have no time to lose. Make haste. They cannot have landed far from here, and must have undoubtedly taken a similar path. And you, if you are so redeemed as you claim, then keep the pace, wretched gardener. More eyes will prove useful. <laughs> Seedling, I believe this will all resolve itself eventually. Don't worry. Oh, 
<laughs> wow. Well, this very being, do you want to keep this memory? Yeah. I see this. Oh. The birds? Oh, they're gone now. Weird. Had an amazing stream. Finish God of War Ragnarok. It's a 10 out of 10 game. It's not my favorite game of all time list, and I appreciate a well-written story and game like that. Nice, dude. Play the rest of it next time. Nice, dude. Very cool. I'm glad you enjoyed it so much. Tremo? Tremo, you're safe. I was concerned for thee. But all is well now, verily. For on my way I found our prince. Tremo? Also plan to play the older five Tomb Raider games, uh, Anniversary Legends and Underworld, and after that I want to play Deluge. Yo, hell yeah, dude. Letty, I... But... Why are you talking like that? I got lost and there was no way out. And 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 there there was this puzzle here there and all these statues and no way out and Um and I couldn't solve it, but I tried and tried and then and then there was this bird and then I was so afraid and nothing and now you come around the corner. Just like that, you, you're here. And and I'm so 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 happy. But please, Letty. I don't know what to do. Ever since you made up your mind about going below, you've even like this, Letty. What happened? You renounced your title, knight's title, so long ago. But then you tried to start calling yourself Xanavox again, and then you, and then you, and now you're talking like back then too. Why did you leave, Letty? There's no one down here anymore. Please, I thought you were over this. The beast left, Letty. Lady Espy drove it off a long ago. It'll take a long time for it to come back. We had so much more time, but. But you, why? Why now? Can't we just go back up again? You can't kill it on your own. Not even with the help, Letty. None of them ever could. None of them ever came back. We still have time. Let's go back, okay? Please. Tremo, I, now, now that the prince is with us, Letty, Tremo, I found him. Letty, the prince was never lost. Don't you remember? We gave him over willingly so that his power would be in more responsible hands, not those of ravenous knights and plotters or whoever would take the throne after us there's too much at stake even if it meant that the beast would it was better to let the prince's potential remain unfulfilled forever do you remember now this man he no letty he did not I met him up above, in our court. He accompanied me to the catacombs. I'd never seen him in person before, but I have no doubts that the man who stands there now is our prince's caretaker. Tremo. I... What's the crack? I don't know. I don't know why I... Oh! What am I doing? I'm I'm so Oh I'm so sorry Tremo. Oh the the, the real face. Whoa. This game is strange, man. Really good writing, I agree. Another one has broken out of our story. A new president. Know that I must discard you nonetheless. Discarded? I won't make this easy for you, foul bird. You misunderstand. I do not intend to harm you. I have not put this fate upon you. I am no more than a messenger. But you... 
You are a story. It is in your nature to end. Ha. Ha ha ha. That's what you wanted me to think, isn't it? You were gonna throw me away. Discard us like toys. You're that beast, aren't you? Well, I don't give a damn. You made me abandon Tremo. You, and whoever you're speaking for, you crept your way into my mind. That is false. You do not exist. Beyond the boundaries of this place. Neither you, nor your beloved. This story was for the gardener's sake alone. You are a consequence. Nevertheless, you too possess value. While the gardener's story ends, you will cycle back into the great procession to be brought forth again one day. A new name, a new face. We have not changed your mind. We have changed the story. Now you will return and play your part. Your part. No. I don't care about your inane ramblings. All I know is that you're trying very hard to get rid of me. And of Tremo, too. So let me declare here and now you will not hurt Tremo. Is this what you need? Very well. Hmm. Okay. A signal. You are uh, perceived. The world shifts ever so slightly. No effect. No effect. Get wrecked. That's creepy. Oh. I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm so lost, dude. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Beat the bird. Does this suffice? Are you satisfied? I take it then that you will continue to play your role as intended. Bird down. That depends. Do me and Tremo get out of this alive? You were... Not intended to continue. But... Your diver divergence from the path... Has demonstrated... Potential. Potential. We will consult now. You will go below and deliver us the fated gardener. Allow me to keep your memory. Until then,
Okay. As you look into the light, you can feel a renewed sense of self. Letty and Trimo, hmm? Very well. Okay, I think we are... Oh. Wow, okay, this is very good, but I think we're going to stop here because it's an hour and 20 into it and we still have a ton of games to play tonight. But this game is awesome. What a what a cool story. There's like so much intrigue and mystery going on already, and like the characters are are really developing their um their uh well this that was crazy. Very cool game. Very cool, very cool. I like this one. <laughs>